Hello and welcome to BMC's Video Solutions. In this video we will talk about enabling SSL TLS communication between ControlM Enterprise Manager Client and ControlM Enterprise Manager Server. Before we begin, make sure you have deployed your SSL certificate on both ControlM Enterprise Manager Server and Client. How to do this is outside the scope of this video. First, we should stop all ControlM Enterprise Manager components. To do that, you need to log into the ControlM Configuration Manager and right click the desired component, choose desired state, and then down. We will repeat this process on all components that can be stopped via the ControlM Configuration Manager. Once we have stopped all components, we need to close all open clients on our computer, like so. Stopping other components that cannot be stopped via the ControlM Configuration Manager is slightly different between Windows and Unix OS. On Windows machine, this can be done from the Services window. Simply right-click the ControlM Enterprise Manager Configuration Agent Service and choose Stop. Next, we need to stop the Configuration Manager server. Go to the command line and run the command Stop CMS. Enter your credentials. And now the CMS is stopped. Last component we need to stop is the naming service. To do this, in the command line, type orbitmin and stop. And now the naming service is down. On Unix machine, to stop the configuration agent, Run the command stop underscore config underscore agent. Select yes. And now the configuration agent is down. Next, we will proceed to stopping the configuration manager server. From the command line, run stop underscore CMS and press enter. Lastly, we will proceed to stop the naming service. To do this in the command line, type orbitmin ns stop. After stopping all components from the command line, we need to run the orb configure utility to configure the ControlM Enterprise Manager server to run in SSL mode. Note on Unix machines, this requires X windows. In the domain configuration window, do the following. Select the use secure socket layer SSL checkbox. In the given path under use tau internal configuration file, change the file name to SSL underscore client underscore server dot conf and click next. In this window, if needed, configure the host and port values and click Next. The summary of the domain configuration setting is displayed. Review the information and click Finish. After configuring the EM server, we will perform the same on the EM client. Now both ControlM Enterprise Manager Server and Client are configured to run in SSL mode. And we can start all components again. First we will start with the configuration agent. To do this, we will go to the services, right click 
and start configuration agent. This in turn will bring up CMS and naming service. The rest of the components we can start from the Control M configuration manager. Open the CCM, click Advanced. Here we can already see we're configured to use SSL. Log into the CCM. For each component, select the component, then right click and select desired state, up. Once all components are up, additional confirmation for SSL can be seen in the WLA client login screen. On the upper right hand, we can see an icon of a lock saying SSL is enabled. All that's left is to do a login and start working. That concludes this Control M Solutions video. Please see our knowledge base and YouTube channel for more videos like this.